Welcome to Sprinkle Time everybody and Happy Mother's Day. In this video, we will be honoring the circle of life and the uterus. Here are some jewels that I made. We've got our sprinkles. And some heart wafers. I'll leave a link in the description box to what products I use. Some blush to add a little bit of sparkle. Our icing colors. Here are the rest of our icing bags with different icing tips. And that's everything. Let's get started. I love you, Mom. I'm sorry that I broke your plate. Let's start off by making these flower transfers. I let them dry overnight and then I stick them on the cookies later. Next, let's make our jewels. So I pour this isomalt into a glass beaker and I microwave it for about five minutes. I'm gonna go ahead and dust the silicone mold with our sparkle. And then I'm gonna pour the isomalt. It doesn't pour completely flat, so I spread it out. After about 5-10 minutes in the fridge, I can break off the edges and it's good to go. I'm so clumsy. Now let's have some fun with some icing. We'll take our white plain icing and put a generous amount in this piece of saran wrap. And then we'll use the darker shade to just put it at the side there. I'm excited to see how it comes out. Careful not to cut your finger. All right, let's test it out. Here is my first attempt. We pour the sprinkles into the well we just made. I just kind of flatten it there. It's beautiful. Okay, our second cookie. Let's try something different. We'll use a different icing tip. I don't know what the heck this one is, but I'm sure my mom will think it's perfect. This one kind of looks like a heart balloon. Let's try using one of our jewels. This one's supposed to be a fancy soap bar. Now let's flood these cookies with love.
I was kind of going for a marble pattern, but that didn't really work out. So I ended up just blending all of this together into one big mush. But uh, I'm determined to fix this. So let's make the perfect shade. Let's grab our blush. Just go ahead and dust that onto the cookies. These ones are supposed to be like a makeup palette. These are the transfers we made earlier. This one is a floral wreath. And finally, the honorable uterus. I had this cookie cutter lying around and I thought maybe I'd use it for this video. <laughs> Let's stick on some of our transfers. What do you call a cute uterus? A cuterus. Let's stick on some jewels. I chose the heart shaped ones. These are supposed to be little hands holding the ovaries, but they don't look like that at all. <laughs> a little shimmer to make that uterus super sparkly. Beautiful. This is not what you think it is. It's a ring. This one is a fluffy pillow. Okay, this is the last one. And to top it off, here is a flower for you, Mom. Happy Mother's Day. Here are all the cookies together. I wasn't able to include all of them in the video, but hopefully you can appreciate them all here. I spelled love out of uterus. Happy Mother's Day to my mom and all the moms out there. 
I love you with all my heart. I hope you enjoyed this video. See you next time.